If you haven't already, go check out my new merch store. Link will be in the description. Hey guys, today we're going to be doing a overview slash review of the objects in The Sims 4 Cats and Dogs. I'm sure tons of people have done this by now. I'm a little late to the game here, but I haven't really sat down and looked at everything and I really want to and I thought I would just give you guys my opinions on everything and if maybe you haven't seen all the objects, I'm going to show you them today. Um, when I played with this in uh, or at Sims Camp, I was blown away by what I saw, but not everything was done yet. So I want to see all of them. So let's start out with the pre-made rooms. There's like a lot. Okay. We have, it's all very country. I like, I really like that, which is so funny because I'm not huge on it in real life, but like I'm loving, loving it in The Sims. It's so cute. Uh, okay. So we have a bathroom, which is like funny that we're starting out with that of all things. Okay. What the, this is like a cute bathroom. Look at this. So cute. Okay. Oh, okay, first off, the mint green door has me shook, um, and then the rest of it is really cute. Look at that plant. Uh, okay, that one's cute. A plus, A plus. Next, we have a with country flare, which looks like a bedroom. Oh, very cute. Aw, I don't know which color scheme to pick. We'll, we'll do this one. Oh, look, okay, look at the quilting on the bed. Oh, and the bed itself. Okay. Oh, look at the little pet bed. I can't. Like, oh, it's so cute. Okay. Oh my god, the door. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm like, I'm barely even saying anything because I'm just kind of like speechless at it. I really like it. Okay, next, what is this? I didn't even look at the, wait, I didn't even look at the color schemes. Okay, we'll pick this one anyways. It is cat-centric. Oh, cat-centric. I see, I see. Oh, this well then this fireplace are you kidding me with that fireplace and the okay these cat towers are like my favorite things ever um i don't have cats but like i still want to buy one like what does that what does that say about yourself okay so there's that love it love the door so cute love the handle i no one cares about the handle it's just me uh, okay the the furniture i love it I remember saying it was very, like, grandma chic. <laughs> it reminded me of, like, an old, like, grandma's home, and it still does. And this little seat thing, just look how cute that is. It looks like a little footrest. Oh, and that's the little Roomba thing, the automatic vacuum. Very cute. All right, let's move on to the, whoops, to the next one, which is Doggard Den. Okay, so this is, like, the opposite, I guess. We'll do this one. Very fancy. Ooh, look at these couches. They're so cool. I love it. Look at the doggy doors. Oh, so cute. Oh my God, this fireplace is new too. I love fireplaces because I don't have one. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, okay. I'm really excited to look at those fireplaces like more in depth. Uh, like, okay. Small town, big bites. What is this? It looks like a dining room. Okay, first thing I notice is this beautiful door. Very nice. Beautiful doggy door to go with it. This plant is rocking my world. So is that one. Let's, let's come in here real quick. Uh, there's, okay, nothing on that wall. There's some paintings over there that are new. A little automatic doggy cat feeder. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm assuming these are also new. Oh, they just look so like... Uh, I don't know. That reminds me of such a grandma. Like, does it, am I the only one that feels that way? It just feels so grandma to me, which is cute. Um, best pet pals is the next one. Looks like a kid's room. We'll do the pink one, obviously. Oh my God. The bed has cat ears. Okay. Oh my God. That is paw prints. Um, this would have been my room if, uh, this furniture existed in my life when I was a kid. Um, this would have been my room. Oh, <gasps> whoa. Okay. Slightly on the creepy side, but I also kind of really like it. Like a lot. All right. Okay. I'm digging it. I love the mirror. So cute. Okay. A plus. A plus on the kids room. Me likey. Next. Oh, we have a, oh, it's an agility course. Oh. <gasps> okay. Fun fact. Um, I think I said this in a previous video, but I have always been obsessed with agility courses. Like when I was a kid, I really wanted to, um, 
like make one for my dogs and like train them and not for like shows or anything. Like I never want to put my dogs in shows, right? But like, I just like to do it for fun. And um, I feel like it's good exercise for them too. And brain power. Uh, and it's a good bonding experience. But yeah, I made like little hoops and stuff when I was a kid and tried to make my dog jump through them. And by hoops, I mean like it was hula hoops because <laughs> Lord knows I didn't have anything fancy. Uh, I had a hula hoop and I was like training my dog to jump through it. It worked for a couple times, but he just mostly wanted the treats I had in my hands. So <laughs> he was like, yeah, I'll do anything. Um, very cute though. I really want to test that out. I'm very excited about that. That one hits home. Uh, and then the last one, I believe, is a bar. Interesting. Oh, this one has mint green in it. That's going to be the one. Oh, it's outdoors. Let's see about the... Oh, well, the lighting is kind of funky on this one. Okay, no, just just, just go back. It <laughs> Just go back. Okay, we have the pretty door again. New fence. Love it. Uh, this bench, like, my grandparents have this. Like, hello? That gra oh, my God. It Am I the only one? It screams grandma, grandparents. Like, I can't be the only one. <gasps> no, the nautical theme stuff. I didn't even see that. See, this is stuff I didn't even see when I was at Sims camp. That's so awesome. It's so fitting with the theme of the neighborhood. Oh, and this is nautical theme too, with a little like submarine looking windows. <gasps> that is adorable. I really like that. I am impressed, EA. I'm impressed. Okay, let's get uh, let's get rid of this one. What am I doing? Hello? Uh, okay, so it looks like that is all of the pre-made rooms. Now we are going to jump into some of these build tools. So I don't even know where to start. Let's just make a room, I guess. I guess we'll go from the ground up. So we'll start with foundations. Um, oh, we need a foundation first in order to do so. So let's... um get a foundation. Hello? I was like, I forgot how to do this. Oh my god. Hold on. That is a really nice foundation. Hold on, let's make it bigger. Okay, that's kind of a huge foundation. That is such a nice foundation. Usually the ones they have in the game are like, I, I can't really use them. I can only really use a few. I love this one. Although I'll probably use this like wood paneling a lot, so it might be kind of a lot if I use it, but I do love it. It looks so good. I really like it. What's the, okay, there's a better view. Um, next we have, we're just gonna go up. Is there new flooring? Yes, there is. I must have already accidentally clicked on this before when I was playing my Let's Play. Let's, um, can I just like put it on the ground? Yeah, here we go. Oh my God, there's so many different colors. <gasps> okay, y'all know how much I love me some good wood floors. So I'm very excited and it makes me even more excited that it has like, um, those kind of country like rustic vibes to it okay especially like this like gray color i feel like that's very rustic uh and then this one looks even more rustic this is so like fixer upper the tv show like I, sh I swear to god everything she makes looks like this and i love it um this is like my favorite like i don't know what it it's just so cool i don't know i like it i like it a lot i was i saw this at sims camp and i was i was honestly like I was shooketh, let's be honest. I was shaking. Um, okay, so that's all the flooring, just two new floorings. Um, what else do we have? I guess, well, what did I say, ground up? Let me. I just wanna make sure I didn't already click on something and I don't wanna miss it. I don't think I have. So we'll go to fences. Um, it looks like there is this new one, which is so cute. Let's look at the different, oh, stop it. I feel like EA did that for me. <laughs> like, <laughs> I love it. I love that, that mint green. I also really like this like, um, natural looking color like the beige and the blues and everything. What is this? That's almost like a bluish tint and then there's a white. Oh, I didn't even notice. Okay. I really like this fence. Very, very cute. And it doesn't get like funky when you have so many it looks like. You know like when some you have like three and it gives like random columns and like not symmetrical places. It kind of drives me crazy. Um, but yeah, this one doesn't seem to be doing that. And then here is the gate. Oh, whoa, it's huge. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, that's... <laughs> Sasha, hello. Uh, that is not the same. That is huge. Wait, there's lanterns on it. Does that mean... It does not light up at night. Oh my god, it lights up at night. Oh heavens what okay a plus a plus gate like i didn't know i could be that excited about a gate but um i've been proved wrong um all right what else do we have we have some new railings oh they look just like uh the ones you were just looking at the what's it called the uh gate fence that's what we were just looking at right 
Hello? What's my mind doing? Uh, where to go? Pets. Very pretty. Oh, and it like connects up here too. That's nice. Me likey, me likey. I love the little details. Next we have columns. Ooh, what's this? Okay, okay. Always looking for some good columns. I like to just like stick them on the corners of my houses. Do they look good when it's like two stories though? Eh, a little bit. I don't have any walls up there, which I'm sure would have helped. They look all right. I'm sure they'll look better on like a, um, what's it called? Like a patio, like a front porch or something. I, I feel like this one, like you just can't beat it because it's just plain Jane. It looks so good on like the corners of your houses. I feel like you really can't beat that one. But um, okay, oh, what's we have a new one of these. All right, hold on, we gotta make a porch. We got to make a porch. Cause we have, oh, and we need the columns. You know what, go ahead and whip out those brand new columns and let's change it to white. There we go. Uh, yeah, sure, go ahead. And what do we have here? Railing. Okay. Oh, it's thick with two C's. I was not expecting that. Ooh. Oh God. Oh Lord help me. It's not what I wanted to do. Okay. So this is like one of these things that you see, like obviously there would be a roof over this, but uh, what are these called? I don't even know what these are called. Spandrels. See, I did not know that. I did not know these even had names. Um, but okay, okay. I'll have to test that out more when I do like a build because it's kind of hard to test out when I'm just kind of messing around with things. Alrighty, so we have that. Next we have, oh, I know we have new windows because I saw them at Sims Camp and I was literally dying. This was one of my favorite things that's that I saw at Sims Camp was the windows. Just in general, the windows. That's amazing. Like we need these so bad. Look how beautiful those are. So there's that one, there is this one, and they, they all come in this mint green color also, which like, I'm dead. Um, there's this one, which is very, like I'm getting a lot of barn feels from this. And I'm like, that just, that makes me wanna make like a barn let's play, like a farm one. I just wanna make it so bad now. This window, I almost fainted when I saw. I almost fainted. And the same with this circle window, because in real life, I'm possibly obsessed with these circular windows. I'm obsessed. Uh, and then what else do we have? This one, very cute. It, they all look very nice. I really like them all. Um, there's this one. There is this one, which is a bit larger, but I love that that it has, I'm pointing with my hand like you can see me. I love that it has like these little baby squares at the top. I guess this one's supposed to probably hit the ground because I think it has this like little outline. Let's see what that looks like on the inside. Oh, yeah, we saw this in one of the pre-made rooms, I'm pretty sure. So nice, God, it looks so good. They really outdid themselves with these windows, honestly. I'm like obsessed with them. Uh, okay, we have this one, very nice. Um, we have this one, which is one of my favorites, really pretty. And um, we have this one, which almost looks like a fancy mirror. It's like really gorgeous. Look how pretty that is. God, it looks so fancy. Uh, and then this one, again, one of my favorites, cause like, that's awesome and so different. And I love that it has the little like window at the top here. <coughs> almost choked, <coughs> sorry. That's really nice. And then we have the easy breezy arch, <laughs> which is, again, I'm getting so many, like, look at that. Like, tell me horses should not be in there. EA, let's make it happen. Uh, okay, so we have that. Those are the windows. They are incredible and I love all of them. Next, we're gonna look at doors. Oh my God, you, I am so obsessed. They're so good. All right, so the first one we have, I, I wish the default color was this white color, honestly, but, that's just me. So we have this one, which is insanely gorgeous. Um, I'm living for all the windows and I just realized they also have one of these at the top. Shook. And then the next one we have is this one. Holy crap. Wow. Okay, that's, whoa, that one's really a lot. That's, hmm, hmm. Not a fan of privacy, those people. Oh, we have new arches? Shut your freaking mouth. God, we needed some new arches. Oh, I love those. Oh, I really like those. <gasps> okay, I got a little excited about those just now, like a little too excited. Oh my God, there's so many colors. Okay, so here is the little, the short uh, short wall barn door, which I'm quite possibly obsessed with. It's really dark in there. I don't even know why I keep going in there, but there's so many colors, God. There's like a blue, again with the mint green. Like EA has just, they are just, uh, yeah. I don't even know. I don't even know what I was gonna say there. Like, I'm just so, 
like the mint green door. Like, are you serious? Like, come on, I am so obsessed. Okay, this one I love a lot because it's very classic. Um, I feel like a lot of people's front doors look like this. And I live in Texas, so like a lot of people have country styled homes and all that jazz, you know. And I feel like a lot of people's front doors look like this. Even people who don't have country styled homes or just have nice front doors, that's what they look like. Oh, this one, I love this one so much. God, I love that door. Like, is it is it possible to be in love with a door? Um, I really like it. Okay, so this is a medium-sized wall. I believe, was this one a medium-sized wall? No. Oh wait, no, this one isn't either. Just kidding. Uh, this is still on the short wall. Lots of windows, quite a lot. I'd probably put curtains or something over that, unless they were like that frosted glass. Uh, but that's real life I'm talking about. Oh my God, the last three are doggy doors. Oh, I am so excited, look how tiny. So, um, okay, they have like different sizes it looks like. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm living. Like, are you serious? Oh my God, I was gonna say, I wish they had mint green ones. They do. Uh, it doesn't look like the biggest one has it, but this one does, which I'm satisfied. Um, these are, whoops, goodbye. These are adorable and like, I can't wait to like show you guys them in action. They're so cute. Uh, okay, so these are the little window accent things. What are they called here? Wall sculptures? Okay, uh, so first we have these things, which, what are they, what are these called? C Corbeller? Yeah, I don't know what these things are called, but they're really cute, and I love that one. I love how smooth it looks. God, I just want to touch it. Uh, okay, we have that one. Again, it comes in all of the colors, you know, the browns, the grays, and the mint green, which I'm living. Where was this when I was doing my mint uh, not so berry challenge. Hello. Um, the next one we have is another one of those. It's just like a little baby one. Next we have a new wall plant, which comes in so many colors. Oh my God. Oh, it's okay. This is so cute. Look at all the colors. I love those flowers. God, the models of them. Oh, that one's the winner. The models of those flowers look really good. Like I'm being very technical about it, but the models of those look amazing. Applause to whoever made those. Oh, oh God, okay, I love awnings. Like, I don't know why I love them. Oh my God, there's so many colors. Oh my God, and there's different roof styles. EA, you have outdone yourself. There's diff, oh my God. Do you understand how many times I've made a house that didn't have the same roof or roof color and just cringed because I wanted to use it so bad, but could it because it didn't match and I didn't want to change anything else? This is like a life life game life game changer life changer same thing you know what i mean and then there's a double a double like shut your freaking mouth this is amazing okay these are i don't know how exciting this stuff is if you're not into building but like that kind of stuff is just like oh it really takes it takes it home for me uh okay oh my god look at this huge tree i gotta move some stuff we're on to the landscaping first we have the most beautiful tree I've ever seen in my life. And it comes in an array of colors. So you can also get like a plain looking like green tree, but you also have these beautiful white ones and then also green and white, which is, on this tree is beyond stunning. It's stunning, I love it. Uh, if I saw that in real life, I'd have to take a picture of it. Uh, the next one we have is a white birch tree, which I think is so beautiful. Birch trees are so pretty. Um, and it also comes in an array of colors, you know fall looking colors that's all i'm saying ea let's make it happen i don't know anything that you guys don't know by the way so don't don't take that to heart but i'm just saying uh, I, I want seasons if you didn't catch on uh, oh my god like come on like the hints like come on god there's so m i i i want to believe they're dropping hints so let me believe it so the next this looks like a little like succulent plant right it looks like a little cacti type of thing it's very cute. Oh my God, there's so many colors. There are so many. Whoa, I thought there was only like three. Uh, and then the next one we have is a cat topiary. Oh, it's so little. Um, we can actually size that baby up. Yeah, we can really get in there with the details. Does it also have colors? No. Okay, so that is the cat topiary, adorable. And then of course we have the proud poodle topiary adorable they actually look pretty good sized up no lie like sometimes things look a little funky but they look pretty good all righty wait a minute can we also size? <gasps> okay so i haven't actually tested that yet the sizing down of objects that just wow i'm wow i'm really excited all of a sudden like oh i'm so excited okay i don't think i missed anything i'm pretty sure we looked at everything that there is to be seen 
just let me double check everything. Nope, we missed some stuff. Okay, so there's some new chimneys. I knew I forgot something because I clicked on them accidentally. All right, so let's go ahead and make like a little square. And of course, if you guys don't know, this didn't come in Cats and Dogs, so you can get this if you have The Sims. You can just update it and get it for free. We have new roofs. Oh yeah, baby. We have octagonal roofs. Uh, well, this is a hexagon. This is an octagonal. This is a pentagon. So we can make like towers and um, what's what else? Like um, gazebos and stuff like that without having to make these like funky roofs out of the other ones. Like is honestly everything. It's everything. I, okay. But for the sake of this video, we're just gonna put this little baby roof on this really like tiny, ugly one. Oh, what the frick? There's new roof trims? I didn't know that. Um, excuse me? Uh, where was I when this happened? Excuse you. Uh, okay, those are um, everything. Is there anything else new that I'm missing from my own personal? Okay. Okay, back to the chimneys. Back to the chimneys. Let's sort this by cats and dogs. So the first one we have is the original. Oh my God, this thing's huge. I should have made a bigger room. Oh God, I should have made a way bigger, way bigger room with a way bigger roof. Yeah, there you go. There you go, buddy. And here we go. This is, okay. Very cute, but very big. Um, obviously it doesn't work on my little square. Oh my God, there's so many. Again, with the different roof types and colors. Like what a freaking blessing. We didn't look at wallpapers. That's what we're forgetting. Uh, okay, this one, I love this one. I seriously, oh, okay. <gasps> the white, I love it. Oh my God. I love that. That's so pretty. And then this one had his little doggy on top. Oh my God. <gasps> or a kitty in every roof color. Like I'm getting such Sailor Moon vibes from the cat in the moon. Such Sailor Moon vibes. All right, we need to move on to the wallpapers. I cannot believe I forgot about this. I'm, I like apologize. I'm gonna remove this so we can get some more light. So the first ones are the indoor ones, which I'm obsessed with so much. So the first one is this one. Oh, I can't just change it like that. Of course, sorry, sorry about it. This, but again, very like grandma rustic. I don't know, that's like how I have to describe everything. Like, look how, like, oh, it looks so pretty. I really love it. I really love it. This one is like a lot of wood. It's like, oh my God. Let me get to a good point here. That's like mostly wood. I don't know how I feel about this one so much. Not my favorite. Uh, not compared to this one, the first one. I really like the first one. And I love this one too. I like when it's just a little bit of the paneling at the bottom. I'm not a huge fan of when the whole thing is paneling. Um, but yeah, I that just looks so nice. Like I feel like I could use that for a lot of different houses. Now the next one is what I believe to be like outdoorsy kind of, um, uh, like exterior kind of wallpapers, which we needed so bad. This looks like a roof style we have, by the way. I'm pretty sure it is. And uh, now we can put it on the walls. Interesting. I don't know. I, mm, I haven't like planned out how I'm gonna use that quite yet, but I do like it. I just haven't figured out how to use it yet. Next, we have some shingles. Oh, they're all roof styles. I think these are all just the roof styles, but they're made into, yeah, made into wallpapers. I did not notice that before. Hello? And this one has the, you know, the little things, which I never use because I always use the columns. Um, same with this one. Same with this one. And then we have the new wood shingling. No, not shingling. What is this called? Uh, paneling, planking. <laughs> Those are shingles, uh, which I really love and will probably use excessively until The Sims 4 is over. So, okay, I believe that is everything. God help me if I missed something. I'm so sorry. Let's move on to the objects. I, I'm not ready. I'm, I'm not ready. We're gonna keep this up so I can use it for the wall decor items. Uh, and then we're just gonna start stacking stuff down. Also, did you guys notice the new grass textures in Brindleton Bay? Just saying, I just noticed. Uh, okay, so the first things we have are some beds. So this is the little kid bed we saw. It is, oh my God, that, the, the, the bed sheets. <gasps> Fire hydrants, oh my God, the bones. <gasps> Stop, no, no, I'm not okay. No, no, mm, no. Now this has been one of my favorite color schemes recently is yellow and pink. I don't know why, I've like really been obsessed with it. So that really makes me happy. And the quilts are killing me. They're, they're so cute. God, like when I was a kid and I was at my grandma's house all the time, this is like what I slept with. Oh, they have some that aren't with quilts though too. 
So if you weren't feeling the quilts, you could just have the normal, um, like, what are they called? Uh, comforters, whatever. What are, I don't know. What, they're called different things at different places. Um, but I really, I really like this one, like a lot. That one's so cute with the little kitties. I love that. Next, we have a double bed. Very cute. Oh, I love the pillows. I, I'm like, the pillows, wow. <gasps> love that. Love some, I love me some good stripes. Uh, oh, love that. Oh, extra love that one. Oh my God, okay. I'm very satisfied with the choice of bedding so far. Oh, this bed. This is my favorite bed of the new ones that I've seen. I think this is all the beds. So this one is my favorite. Um, I can't, I'm dead. I, can you guys imagine the custom content to come out of this? I probably won't download it because again, when I build stuff, I like you guys to all be able to download it, but still, like, can you imagine? Um, okay, so this, oh my God, this is so freaking cute. Look at the little, like, what is this? I don't even know what this is called at the bottom where it like hangs, it like kind of drapes down. Like, so grandma, I, I just, I'm obsessed. I love it. Look at the colors. Look at that, that's so cute. Oh God, it's so good. Okay, we have the Ottoman, which I'm horribly obsessed with. Oh my God, there are so many colors and different patterns too. Oh wait, I love that plaid. I love that. Man, this is cute. It just keeps getting better and better. All right, oh, I love that color too, a lot. Okay, wow, I'm, th this might be one of my new, or what, my, one of my favorite new items. My favorite fall vegetable is a sweet potato. Okay, now moving on, we have the uh, matching chairs here, so, oh, that's not matching. I was gonna do the stripes, but I messed up, so moving on. Next, we have the big cozy chair. Oh my God, with the blanket over the top of it. I wanna see what it looks like on the back. Very cute, very cute. I think I love this. Oh, the pa the patterns, like, uh, okay, that one's kind of a lot. Uh, actually, like, I take it back. That one's kind of a lot. The, the other ones are so good. Like, I okay, this green color, I'm living for this green. I love it. That is so pretty. Okay, next we're moving on to some dining chairs. These, oh, these look a little worn and torn. Oh, but they also have, well, yeah, they have, it looks like they have some options that aren't as worn and torn also. So if you weren't into that kind of worn outlook, you could also just use the one that's not. Uh, all right, moving on, we have another dining chair. Again, I swear my grandparents at one point had this chair uh, and the ones with the cushions, which, yep, they're coming up. I see them in there, love them. They just hit home so much for me. So this is the dining chair version, it looks like, of the other ones that we saw on that side. Very cute. Now this one, I'm pretty sure my grandparents had at one point. Oh yeah, no, they did. They, yeah, they 100% did. And the cushion was like a red plaid. That's what they had. So it's like, you know, one of these, like that's like the closest I think we're gonna get. But like, come on. They literally had this chair. The wood was that color. Like, that's so funny to me. Like, I love that. I love that it's so realistic. I love it. It's so cute. I can relate so much. Relatable, hashtag relatable. Uh, all right, moving on to the new couch. I'm so obsessed with this. I love the pillows. Oh, the pillows have buttons on them. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Um, okay, what's the next one? Oh, yes, this, this bench. Again, my grandparents most definitely had something like this. A hundred percent, like a hundred percent. Next, we have another bench. Ooh, it has a flower on it. Oh my God, a cat, stop. And a bone, stop, that's so cute. I love the cat, I love that. Man, that's so cute. Oh, I love that, so pretty. Okay, this one, this is one of the like game changers for me is the corner seats. Oh my God, it has flowers in it might I add? So this one would be very good outside, I think. Uh, it's obviously like it's made out of, oh yeah, outdoor love. There we go. It's made out of like concrete or something. So clearly made for outdoors, but it's beautiful. Like I love it. I love it. I just, I'm obsessed. Next we have this. Ooh, I forgot about this. I forgot all about this. It's a love seat, I believe. And the, okay. I don't know. It's, it's the pillows. The pillows really, really take it to a new level for me. I don't know, I just, I like that level of detail. 
And of course, like we've had all the couches without pillows. And so now that we have them, it's like, a, I don't know, it just looks a lot better to me. So this is the indoor one. I think there's also, there's another one after this too. Um, I'm fully 100% obsessed. Um, we'll never get over it. No, no. Oh, wow. Never going to get over it. Never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. Um, oh my, the pillows. Like, it just. It almost sounded like I was going to cry, but like, honestly, no, for real. Like, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. And there's books in there. And look, oh, the drawers are plum bobs. That's so cute. I didn't even notice that before. <sighs> Take a deep breath. Here we go. Next, we have a dining table. So we have like a little like breakfast room one. Again, very rustic looking, fits the theme. Oh, I like this one. Love that. I'm gonna scoot that over. Next, we have a long table. Ooh, I'm assuming, yeah, same colorings. Again, very rustic. I really like this one again. Next, we have the rustic classic. Look at me, I know my styles. Uh, well, at least no rustic because Texas. They, they do that a lot. So here we go with this. I love this again. I love this like wood paneling. I think it's really cute on the table. Love it. Next we have rustic hallscape. Oh, it's like an accent table. It looks like a workbench, right? I think that's probably what they were going for. I think that's a very popular rustic style. Eh, I don't know how I feel about it. Will I use it? Probably at least a few times, but mm, not my favorite item. Um, but anyways, the rustic access. Oh, it's a dresser. Oh, that's cute. I like that this one, it like, does it have? No, it doesn't look like it's super worn. A lot of the dressers in The Sims have that kind of worn out look and I'm not a huge fan, to be honest. I'm never really been a huge fan of that. So the fact that this doesn't have that makes me really happy. Um, knotted in table. See how this one's kind of worn? Yeah, see, not my favorite look. I don't know. I don't like that. I like things to look new. Yeah, see, like this one. If it had another pattern that didn't have that worn look on it, that would be fine. But yeah, it's, I just really can't get into it. It just looks, I don't know. I just don't like it that much. Me, I wish I could get into it, but I can't. Uh, next, we have Mr. Wolf and Mrs. Meow Nightstand. So this is the one from the kids' room. It's so cute. It almost looks like very futuristic with that shape. But I love that the paw prints and everything is so cute. Um, next we have the end to end table. Now this one I like. Uh, I love the little um, dangling handles, the little circles. Those are so cute. Uh, I don't know. If the, oh, oh, huh. dang. We just got, we went from rustic to like chic, fancy. Uh, black and white, I don't know. It's just so fancy to me. Um, okay, next. Oh, we have another end table. God, I love end tables. So like, I'm so excited. <gasps> yes, okay. I've. It's been redeemed. It's been redeemed. Does this, okay, no. What was the difference? What is this? Okay, this almost looks like a bathroom counter to me. Does it not look like that to you? Like that's what like I feel like our bathrooms look like. Uh, but anyways, here is a coffee table. Very cute. Oh, I like that the, the little uh, metal bar underneath is a different color. That's nice, it was always black. I really like that. So this one, is that wood? Yeah, okay. I couldn't see, it's kind of bright outside. So little, whoops, little difficult to see with the white colors, but I love that. It looks very nice, very simple. I like that it's really easy because you can match it with everything. It doesn't have to just be this set of furniture. A new desk, oh, this is so cute. Oh, okay, okay. No, this might be one of my favorite items. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is about this item. I don't know what it is. Look at that, look at those like tiny little legs. Uh, <laughs> it's so cute. I don't know why I like that so much. I really like that, that desk, like a lot. I don't know why. All right, next we have a wall um, shelf, which is so cute. If I can just get it to stay put. The, oh, I love that. Tell me that doesn't look like a freaking like Oreo or something. Like Oreo vibes. Okay. <laughs> no, I just, I. I love that, that's very cute. Do they connect by any chance? Cause like, that's a problem. Oh, my walls aren't like long enough, hello? Let's see, I guess we'll move this over. I wanna see if they um, if they connect. No, well that kind of sucks. I mean, you can do it with move objects, but I was hoping they kind of just connect. Oh well, um, oh, here we go, here's some pet stuff. Look at that, it holds the leashes and everything. So cute. I actually have one of these myself. It doesn't look quite this fancy. Um, I have one for Yuna. It's like a little chalkboard with some 
hooks on it and I hang her leash on there too. But this is so cute and I, I love this little style so much. It almost, it's like graham crackers, Oreo s'more looking, I don't know, but I love it. I love that so much with the brown and the white. I'm like obsessed with that. Next, we have an entryway shelf. Shut your freaking mouth. That is adorable. Screw the entryway. <gasps> the coloring's in there too. Yeah, screw the entryway. We're using it all over the place. Oh, dude. Okay, so you see how this is like the plain wood. Look at this one. Look at it. It's got the little like markings of like wood. It looks like real wood. Okay, love that. <laughs> love it. Just a touch of hutch. So it's like a kitchen type of thing. Or no, bathroom. Bathroom. I thought this was, this is very fancy for a bathroom. I was thinking kitchen for sure. <gasps> Okay, I'm seriously obsessed with this coloring, like as you can tell. And this one too, I really like that one. Oh, that's so nice. Love it. Oh, this one's for the kitchen. Holy crap. Oh my God, this is huge. This is a china cabinet, like china cabinet queen. Honestly, like it's huge. I love it, but my God, is it big? Okay, I love the detail inside. Love it. I really like it. I just hope I can uh, use it in my houses because they're not super huge. Um, all right, the lover's picnicker. Oh, knicker. <laughs> That's so weird to say. Um, okay, again, with I think this is like some coloring we saw before. Really like it. Very rustic looking again. Like it. Oh, I love the sides. I love the X's. Very cute. Next, we have an outdoor patio piece with an umbrella. <gasps> I love, I love it, I love it. Okay, so just the umbrella changes colors? Or no, each row has a different table color. I see, I see, they're very subtle though. Love it, love it. Oh, we got some bathroom pieces. We got a new toilet, how cool. Um, Don't know if I'll use it, but we have a new toilet. It, there it is. And then now we have a new sink. Oh my God, no, I love the sink. I No, no, I love it. I, I'm obsessed. Those freaking, um, those knobs to turn on the water, I'm, they're everything. They're everything. Uh, we have a new bathtub. Oh my God. It's so cute. I feel like we have a bathtub that looks pretty similar to this, but hey, we have some like copper rose gold look looking stuff. I love that too. So let's bring it on here. Oh my God. Here is that bar that we saw a minute ago in that one pre-made house, or no, pre-made room build. Very cute, nautical themed. I'm not gonna put that down because it's kind of big. <gasps> New aquarium? Shut up, the lighthouse is in the aquarium. Are you kidding me? That is in Brindleton Bay and now it's in this aquarium. Oh my God, it's so nice. With the cabinets at the bottom, wow. That is so nice. That's a fish who lives in style. Love it. Next we have, oh, oh my God, okay. This is a public restroom. <laughs> it's kind of funny that it's in here. I didn't think that they put these in here. Very cute. I'm not gonna put it down because it's kind of massive. We have, oh, the food stands. Okay, what is this one? Foodies Munch and Go. Okay, we have seafood sampler and catch of the day, so all very seafood. And let's go back over here, we have some wall decor. Oh, cute. Okay, so we have just like some little like signs and posters, there's like some beer, some words, an ice cream cone. Why are there so many? Oh my God, there's so many. Ooh, that one's really cool. Uh, we have this one, oh, this is like the vet stuff, yeah. <gasps> I love it. Oh my God. It's so cute. Oh, look at the burger. I'm not sure what all the food items are for, but I really like them. Again, very like pet stuff, nautical theme. <laughs> Mr. Krabs looking crazy. Um, okay. Oh, that, oh, I love that one. Um, oh my God, this is huge. Love it, so cute. Oh no. Abandoned, um, shook, I'm shooketh. Okay, okay. Distressed, okay, well, interesting. Love these paintings, by the way, love them. I love that they're so small, but they look so nice. Oh my God, they're playing, what is it called, Don't Like the Llama? I think I finally remembered the name. Look at that, that is so awesome. I love that, love it. Oh, wow. Oh, it changes. Oh my God, that scared me when it changed. 
Oh, that's so pretty. Actually, that's kind of sad. Oh, I, my heart hurts now. Um, but I love the frame. It's so fancy. Oh, this one too. Oh, these are so nice. God, they've gotten so good with these paintings. Um, okay, we have a medicine cabinet for your bathrooms. Very nice. We have some animal directioning. Oh, that's cute, little kitty. Oh, the little puppy. Ah, why well, that's so funny. No barking here, no pooping here. <laughs> that is hilarious. What is this? Lawn sign. Okay, okay. For your for your vets <laughs> or for well any businesses you want to run. Oh, look at that, guys. The mint green has made a return. Uh, what else do we have? That looks like a groomer, right? Okay, we got a burger one. Oh, what is, uh, yeah, this hangs. I was like, where's this go? This is like a billboard looking thing. Gee, that's for those, that's for those fancy vets. Those are the ones that have made it already. We have a little, what is this called? Captain Wheel replica helm. Okay, what is this? Oh no, it's a gravestone. Oh, that's so sad. Um, oh, Brindleton Bay, a model? Are you serious? I'm gonna get in there. Why don't they have this for all the worlds? This is so nice. No, I really like that. Like, a, I love that. Oh my God. Like a huge statue of an anchor. Love it. Um, we have stack of books. Oh, decor items. Yes. Yes. I love this. I, we always stack, you know, everybody stacks books on everything. So like, that's so nice. <gasps> rugs. Okay, I specifically always ask for more rugs when I go to, um, Sims camp <laughs> because I feel like we just need more. And so now I feel like they've delivered <gasps> so cute. Like again, very grandma. I love it. I'm such a grandma myself. So like this makes me so happy. That's so good. I love these rugs. Nature's design. Okay, interesting. We have a circles in motion. Interesting. I'm not sure where I would like use these rugs to be honest with you, but okay. Marvelous mega mat. Oh my God, this one's big. We got a big one. No, it comes in different designs. Cute. Oh my God, a lot of different designs. <laughs> hello, oh my God, when does it end? When does it end? There it goes. I was like, hello, that was a lot. Okay, that one's a good one. Oh, we got the fireplaces. All right, we gonna put these up against the wall. Looks a little funky because it's hanging over the edge, but it's fine. I love that they go up the wall, but they still have mantles. Love that, love that. To death. I can't wait for Christmas so I can put some wreaths up there. Oh, can't wait for Christmas. It's November 10th. Who are we kidding? It is Christmas. Okay, so next we have this one, which is so beautiful. Oh my God, that coloring again. I'm gonna lose my mind. Oh, I love it. Oh my God, they're so pretty. Holy freaking crap. Okay, so I really like this fireplace. I like both the fireplaces, but that one especially. Very nice. You can put things on top of this, correct? I, I need to know. I don't want to get out of here because I don't want to mess it up. But I want to like, I want to know if you can put stuff on the wall. I don't know. It's not looking like you can actually, which is a shame because I really thought you could. Uh, that's kind of a problem. I mean, move objects might be able to fix it, but hopefully. What is this? Billboard? Oh. Just put whatever you want on there, I guess. Um, we have the net. We saw this in the little bar area earlier. Very, very cute. Uh, we have the little bottles, again, that we saw earlier. Cute. We have the last sign you'll ever see. Well, that's a little scary. Um, <laughs> anyways, we have wall-mounted captain's wheel. Cute, very nautical. Uh, we have the, oh, vet sign, cute. We have the Mr. Crab sign. We have, an, oh, we're back into objects now. What? Random order. Uh, we have the little dresser for the kids. Cute. Oh, shut. Stop. 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 No. <gasps> I didn't, I never expected this. Uh, okay, if that didn't make you want to buy cats and dogs, this right here really should. Look at that. Okay. 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 I'm, I'm sold. I already have it and I'm sold. <gasps> this lamp. I love this lamp. Oh, 
Oh, I love it. It's so cute. Um, oh, this is a hanging lamp. This is the one that was on that gate. I really love this. I really like this, like a lot, like a lot. This is like one of my new favorites. Uh, we have, oh my God, this one's huge. Holy crap. It's very beautiful. It's very big. Very cute though. I oh, green, yes. That green color I'm like living for, I love it. Um, oh my God, we have the automatic vacuums. I guess this needs to go against a wall. Yeah, if I can get it against the wall. This foundation is kind of a lot. Oh, it's going on the inside. I see, I see. Uh, well, I wanted to just look at the colors, but I guess that's not gonna happen. This is the, oh, there is no colors. Oh yeah, there is. There's a pink, hello, pink, red, okay. These are the automatic vacuums that um, the cats can jump on, which is so cute. And that one has a rainbow paw on it. I don't know if you can see that. Um, I'm living, I'm living. Um, but next we have a book storage. What did that say? Stowage? Uh-huh. Um, okay. Again, loving the plumb bob detail at the bottom. Very cute. I like that it already has pictures and books on it. Saves me some time. Um, the floating shelf. Why is it floating? I don't know, but that detail on the top is amazing. Love it. Love that one. It's beautiful. Split panel dresser. What? Look at the detail inside. Is this like an actual dresser dresser? Or is this like a decor item for like bathrooms? Either way, I really like it. It looks like a bathroom kind of item. Um, we have this dresser. Oh my God. Okay, this goes up there as one of my favorite new items as well. That's insanely beautiful and I'm obsessed. Next, we have some pet stuff. We have the doggy beds. Oh my God. I'm gonna lose my freaking mind. <gasps> and when I say doggy beds, I'm pretty sure cats can also sleep on these. I just... I don't know, as a dog person, I always say doggy beds, but yeah, I'm pretty sure cats can sleep on that too. <gasps> they have the fancy quilting looking pattern. Fun fact, in real life, that is my favorite thing in the world. Okay, the quilts, living, love them. But this, oh my God, you have, I'm just obsessed. I'm obsessed, I, I just can't, I just can't. Uh, okay, now we have some litter boxes, very nice. They look like, it looks like a litter box. This one is a covered litter box. Yep. <laughs> uh, we have a, another litter box, scoop free, automatic scooper, nice. And then we have this one, which I think is so cute. And this one is the self cleaning litter box and it's called litter laser. So I'm pretty sure the eyes are lasers. Yeah, I've never seen this in action. So I'm very excited. Um, so yeah, we have that one, but I love it. I think it's super cute. Next we have the medicine crafting bench, which you can use in your vet clinics to also sell medications um, rather than just work on the pets yourself, which is very cool. Love it. Uh, we have, of course, the doggy and cat toys. There's some balls here. Uh, there's a little kitty, there's a little ducky, a mouse. We have the, um, these are for cats. They're little wand things which I have played with a little bit in my Let's Play. And then we have the rings for your, can cats do this too or is it just dogs? I feel like it might be just dogs, but these can also be set on fire. So they can jump through literal rings of fire. Um, we have the little toy chest, which is so cute. And I love that you can see the toys in there and you can also click on this to, never mind, the toys are gone. Uh, I love that you can click on this and buy toys. Oh, I guess that, that might be what puts the toys in there. Oh, the detail. Um, the outdoor pet storation device. Okay, so this is apparently for outdoors. Okay. Don't see why you couldn't use it indoors too, but okay. Next we have, oh, the obstacle platform. This is again for the agility course. So is this one, and they don't come in any more colors, by the way, I'm, I'm trying to change it, but there is none. Um, we have this one, which is like the little things that they run in between. Um, play on the go toy box. Um, this kind of looks like this one, but a little bit bigger. I actually really like this one. I like it. I even kind of like the distressed one, to be honest with you. Like, I, again, you know, I'm not big on that, but I kind of like it on, on this toy box. Uh, ooh, okay, we have the big tunnels. These do have three colors. They come in red, yellow, and blue. Oh, the blue has little puppies and kitties on it. Cute. Uh, we have this one, which again, comes in a couple of colors. Oh, I'm too late to change it, but the same colors. Um, we, oh my God. 
It's a tire with plants in it. Oh my God. I love that. Okay. Wow. I'm obsessed. Um, I'm, can, I'm, we'll just make that one tiny, tiny. Oh, I want to put it on top of there. Eh, move objects. Save me. Uh, okay. Sunflower. Oh, cute. I actually really like sunflowers like a lot. They've kind of grown on me in the past like year or two. I used to really not be into them, but now I'm obsessed. And this I'm obsessed with also. Look at that. Are those tulips? Are they tulips? I don't know. Looks like tulips to me. Again, I want to compliment the models on these flowers. They look really nice. Um, okay, we, we already looked at the wall planter that goes in the wall. Oh, heavens. It's a cat planter. <gasps> oh my god, they have such personality. Look at their faces. Look at his little face. His little tongue. So cute. Puppulent, succulent. Who made that? I love you. <gasps> That's such a good name. Oh my, my word. Wait, that is Yuna. Like, that is Yuna. That looks just like Yuna in puppulent, succulent form. Yes. Yes. <laughs> uh, okay, pawing on the walls. Oh, this goes on the wall. I thought it was a floor thing. Okay, are there different colors of this? Can we get into a spot? Very cute. L another little wall decor. Climbing on the walls, paws on. Okay, so a bunch of little wall decor items. Okay. Very cute for kids' rooms, especially. Or uh, another vet clinic thing. <gasps> okay, that. Oh, they buried a bone. Okay, I thought it was like. I thought it was like a dead pet. I was like, okay, whoa, what just happened? Okay, what is this? Oh, slobbery ball. Yep, that is a thing. What is, oh, it's a mouse, okay. It's hard for me to get any closer, so I'm sorry if it's like kind of hard to see. These are scratches, um, I guess from like if your pet's scratching on the walls. Uh, been there, done that. Um, <laughs> okay, another, I think this was the picture inside of the billboard, so we have that. Oh, we have new calendars. I love, love these calendars. I feel like I have this calendar, of course, because it's got the husky on it and like we all know. <laughs> Sasha's obsessed with her own dog. Adopt a pet. Oh, adoption posters. We have a cat breeds poster. Cute. What's this uh, cat's like all about cat's anatomy. Cute. All about dog breeds. Um, dog anatomy. So cute. Cat's inspiration poster oh, and a dog one. That's so cute. Welcome to the vet. Oh, this has different colors. Oh, it just changes the icon. Icon? Yeah, whatever. You get what I mean. Um, oh, Mouse in the wall. I feel like we already had that. I guess not. These are some locked ones. Okay, those are there's a vet skill. Oh, shoot. I didn't even know that. Oh, we have curtains. Yes, curtains. Okay, let's go over here and look at those. Okay. I am always, always happy for new curtains. I Look, I love these. I love the plaid. I love it. Oh, oh, the flowers. So cute. Okay, I really like those. So this is the like left side. We have some paws and some dead fish and some kitty cats. Yes, okay, and that's the other side. Looks exactly the same. We have this one. I'm assuming it's, yep, it's the same. And then we have the Bella curtain, which is like the longer version of the first one we saw. Very cute. We have this one, which is one of my new favorites. It's the classic country curtain. Again, look at that. I love that, I love that plaid. Oh, and this one too, I really like that. Oh, stars. Girl, I love me some stars. Yeah, oh, I love this color. I'm living. <gasps> That's my favorite. Okay, and then moving on. Oh, this one kind of gets a little cut off. Again, the extra long version of the first one we saw. This is a bigger version of the classic country. Very nice, very nice. Uh, we have this one. Again, I think we already looked at that. Oh, they're just getting bigger. Okay, and then we have the awnings, which we looked at. What are these? Are these... Like, oh, they're decor items. Okay, okay. Let's get over here on the tables then. Oh, I don't like this red color. Okay, there we go. Here we got some really fancy like sculptures. So we have like a fox, it looks like. Man's best friend. Oh, I guess it's just a dog. It looks like a fox. This is a kitty. And then we have ceramic cat. Very cute. I'm gonna look at all the different designs. Ceramic dog. Cute. Aw. 
They're so cute. Um, and then we have Booping Schnoops. Oh, they're booping their noses together. Okay. Okay. I'm fine. I'm okay. Woofskers Nibble Yums. Oh, it's like pet food. That's so cute. Oh my god, my house looks like that. Um, for necessary instruments. Oh, that's vet stuff. That is some needles and yeah. Um, for swabs and cotton balls, also pet stuff, but not really. I have this stuff in my bathroom. Uh, we have chewy snackies. Stop! <gasps> it's treats, guys. I can't. Crunchy bits. Oh my god. Again, looks like my house. Pile of the Sims Daily. <laughs> I wonder, I guess they can like maybe use the restroom on that or something. Cute. Okay, so we have some paw prints for the ground. Oopsies. I would I assume that you would use these in like the vet also to kind of like direct them where to go, you know. Um, place food here, Matt. Oh, this is like where their food goes. Again, I also have one of these. Rustic paw accents. Oh, muddy paws. Okay. Okay. Fuzzy welcome, Matt. Love it. Here's a kitty one. Here's some bones. Oh, I love this one. It's one of my favorites. Oh, what the hell? I didn't know it changed. <gasps> oh, the heart. Oh, and now it's even more my favorite. No dogs here. Heartless. No cats here. Heartless. Um, and then accepting. Accepting. Yes. <laughs> Rest your paw here, rug. Okay. We have a diagram of a dog. Let's go put that over here. Ah. Oh my god, we're- no! It's getting complicated! It's getting complicated. Okay, so we have a dog diagram and a cat diagram. We have the pupper radiography. So there's skeletons, and I guess that's also a cat, question mark. We have the- oh, that's really cute. Little kitty sign, and then the puppy sign. Love it. We have love all paws. Aw, so accepting of both. Uh, what else do we have? Crates a million small. I think, are these decor items? I guess so. So we have some crates here. Okay. Okay. I like it. Oh, wow. That one's really big. Okay. Okay. We have, what is this? A corner shelf? Oh, cute. Oh, I really like that. That's super nice. Next we have, whoa. <laughs> Whoa, some more crates, but a lot of them. All right, and some more. Wow. And then we have a typical nautical divider. Oh, I love me some good stained glass. Yes. Now we have some pet bowls. Cute. We have this fancy one, also cute. We have the automatic feeders, which for some reason like won't change colors for me when I click it, but they change colors. Um, and then there's this one, which again, won't change colors for me for some weird reason. It's making that weird noise. I don't know what's going on. But there's that. Cute. We have the scratching post. Essential for cat owners. Um, let's see what else. Claw satisfier. Also another form of a scratching post. What else do we have? Oh my god, the cat towers. Yes. Yes, honey. Yes. I'm so obsessed with these. I have a dog and I want one of these anyways. Um... Look at that, like they're so fun. They're so cute, I love them. Look how cool they are. God, they're cool. Man, I, I've like always liked these. They're really fun. It almost reminds me of going to like Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> Which I haven't been to in a while, but God, now I wanna go. Um, the dreaded pet carrier, aw, that's sad. Um, what else do we have? The tail waggers tabaret. I don't know what that is. Looks like a vet thing. It looks like a vet thing. Um, oh my god. I don't know if you can see this, but you see the, the mailboxes? They unlock with the level two of the vet career. They're amazing. Uh, we have the check-in podium for the vet so that customers can check in. We have a medicine vending machine. This one's a little sketchy looking. This one's less sketchy looking, but this one is probably cheaper. Oh yeah, lots... A lot cheaper. Um, we have the exam table. Oh, this is like the El Cheapo one. It's all busted up. And this is the not El Cheapo one. Very nice. We have a... What is this? Oh, the surgery thing, right? Again, the busted up one. Love it, love it. And then we have the not busted up one. You guys are catching on to a pattern here. Um, oh, we have new lights. All right, let's go put this baby down. 
We have a lantern. I'm loving the lanterns, by the way. I'm a huge fan. So yes, more lanterns. <gasps> no, but my grandma has this lamp. Like she has it and it looks like that. Like, don't play with my emotions like that. Um, what is this? Oh my god, it's a lamp. I'm gonna cry. That is so freaking cute. God, how could they? It's so nice. All right, let's go inside. Oh yeah, we're gonna light this baby up. All right, so here is one of the first lights. Very nice. I love it a lot. Here is one of the second ones. This was a little bit longer. I would put this over maybe like a dining room table or something. Cute. And then the last one is the suspended runway. I like really like this one, to be honest with you. This is really nice. Really cute. I would put that over like an island or something. And it looks like, guys, it looks like we have completed the objects overview. It took me almost an hour, but we did it. There's a lot of new stuff here. Not everything is that's new is even placed down. I ran out of room, if that's saying anything for you. I would buy this, even if I didn't want the pets, which like, again, heartless. Uh, if someone didn't want the pets, I would still buy this for the items um, because they're incredible. And they really hit home with me because my grandparents like have most of these things. So like, that's really funny to me. Um, but I really, really love the new items. There's a few that I probably won't use. But for the most part, I really do like all of them. Um, there's just like a couple. Just a couple I'm a little weird about. Other than that, though, I mean, I'm pretty satisfied. Like, the majority of them I'm very, very happy with and will use time and time again. I'm so excited to get more into this pack. You guys have no idea. I hope you guys enjoyed my little objects overview. Please leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think of the objects in the game. Do you like them? Would you buy this game just for the objects? Because I totally would. Don't forget to click the bell on my channel to receive notifications when I upload and become part of the early squad. Hope you guys are having an awesome day and I will see you all next time. Bye.